And people living near that search area are taking extra precautions. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Nikki Dementri spoke with homeowners who live not too far from where he was seen on camera. And they're concerned, Nikki. Yeah, they're absolutely concerned. And as you both mentioned, several of the roads in this area remain blocked off as that search continues for Cavalcante. Now, we spoke with some neighbors who backyards go right up to the edge of Longwood Gardens, and they say right now this is all hitting a little too close to home. I hear them circling all, like every day, all day for the past few days. So it's just been. It's been a lot, but you know, a little scary. Raina Robbins woke up to the news, escaped inmate Daniello Cavalcante was spotted not far from her house, which backs up to Longwood Gardens off of Baltimore Pike. So I woke up at like 6:45 and I just made sure the doors were locked. Monday night, officials say this surveillance photo from a private trail camera shows Cavalcante at Longwood Gardens. It's just tiring, it's exhausting, and just your nerves are on edge and you just second guess everything. Joanne Shiley, too, lives in the old Hammerton neighborhood. Her kids are home from school after both the Unionville, Chadsford, and Kennett Consolidated school districts closed. You don't think so, um, September should be a snow day. <laughs> Neighbors say state police went door to door near Dogwood Drive Tuesday, checking properties and making sure everyone is okay. They just asked us to. Keep alert and keep your doors shut and asked if we were okay. That's the fear. As time goes on, he gets more and more desperate, so you never know what he's going to do. Until Cavalcante is caught, Shiley, Robbins, and their neighbors will continue to check on each other. The few neighbors that I'm like directly around, we all are kind of like, okay, you know, like just, just stay safe. We're all kind of just texting updates. Now, those neighbors we spoke with all agree that they are confident Cavalcante will be caught soon. Authorities are saying until then, if you know anything about his whereabouts, please call them with a tip. That number is on your screen right now. It is 717-562-2987. Again, it's 717-562-2987. For now, live in Chester County, Nikki DeBentry, back to you both in the studio. All right, Nikki, and so many students can't get back to school this week. Thank you for that. As soon as there are any updates on the search for Danilo Cavalcante, you can always find the latest breaking news on our website, cbsphiladelphia.com.